So yo, what's up guys? In this video here, as you can see, we finally have a uh, star buff, which is obviously the Japanese equivalent to Brilliant Stars, which release in English next month. And this will basically have the Arceus cards, the Charizard cards of that set in Japanese here. And if you've seen my uh, community post or you're in my Discord, you might have seen I've may have picked up some cards and I don't want to spoil it yet we'll save it for the end of the video but I got one box here which we're gonna open uh, this is an unsealed box because this one came from the Pokemon Center and I believe they opened the boxes there so my mate hooked me up in Japan of course you guys know I've got a friend in Japan that picks me up the boxes uh, but yeah basically we're gonna be doing a box break on this set so hit the link in the description if you want to get part we will have sealed boxes there we're gonna do YouTube one uh, so the YouTube one will be on Sunday and then uh, we're going to be doing a TikTok one. So if you want to get take part in the YouTube one, you buy the packs on FamousGrow.com. And if you want to take part on the TikTok one, you go on my TikTok at 8 p.m. today, and you can buy them live on stream with TikTok Shop. So we'll be doing two box breaks because the TikTok Shop is only available for the UK, and I want everyone worldwide and anyone that want prefers YouTube as well to enter. So you can buy them on FamousGrow.com. And yeah, we are going hard on our TikTok. So follow our TikTok. Uh, but yes, we've got one box here, so I'm going to be opening one box for myself and then I've got another four boxes because we're going to do a 100 pack opening, uh, so I'll be about 150 packs in total I'll be opening for myself. I may open more in the future, however, what I show you later shows you why I won't really need to open them uh, too many anyways. I, I still want to get a lot of cards from the set, but I see something here and oh, I was scared for a second. I thought that was a full art and that's our secret slot gone, but our Whimsicott V, we'll go straight to the rare. Uh, we don't really need to see the comments and uncomments, um, but yeah, let's go. So come on, let's see what we can get. So yeah, it's been a while since we opened the main set. We had uh, VMAX Climax, which we opened over a thousand packs of with my personal openings and box breaks. A so shout out to everyone that supports and get got packs for that. Ah, uh, but boom, okay, Phenone here. I think it's Phenone or uh, actually um, it might be the other evolution of it. I can't remember, but yeah, there is that in this set. So they always have to, like with a great set like this, you got Charizard and Arceus, but they always have a couple card stinkers in there just to have, or I don't know, just so the players can have it, you know what I mean? Because players obviously don't care if they have a Charizard or not, as long as it's playable for them. And boom, B Barrel, um, Holo, and I think this is going to be in prom uh, the pre-release, one of the pre-releases for the English version. So there we go. So hopefully, obviously with Japanese, you get one secret rare per guarantee per box, while well, you can get two secret rares per box. So hopefully we have a two secret rare box here. And yeah, we're just opening this today just for my collection and we'll see what we can get. Uh, there is a lot of cards and I've only bought the main few. I want to show you guys now, but I don't want to spoil it. I'll show you towards the end. Um, so you guys don't skip to the end. It'll be somewhere random. Ooh, Professor. I'm not sure what this is. What's his name again? But... Uh, let me know down in the comments. I do re Rowan. Is it Rowan? Let me know. Um, I feel like it's Rowan. He looks like a Rowan. Uh, but yeah, let's go. Come on. Boom, 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 boom. So obviously, unlike a high class set like we had with VMAX Climax and like every other regular uh, Japanese set, you're not guaranteed to hit in every pack. Uh, so like that. So, but the pull rates are so much better than English. When I'm doing box breaks, I think as long as you buy more than one pack, you're at least walking away with a hit. Oh, Moltres, and this is also going to be a pre-release in English, so can't wait for that. So there we go. So yeah, but it's always good fun, and it, this set, like, everyone always leaves happy because you're at least leaving with a hit. Oh, Raichu, there we go, Raichu's in this set. Is there a Pikachu in here then? Or you don't really need the Pikachu because the V cards don't need the evolution like the GXs. Uh, so is there a Pikachu? Because I would I always collect the commons and uncommon Pikachus, uh, like the non-holo Pikachus. So yeah, I don't think so. I haven't seen a Pikachu, right? Otherwise I would have pointed it out. Uh, but come on. Alright. So yeah guys, make sure to get your packs. You can buy a full box or you can buy loose packs. We also have on TikTok, we also have VMAX Climax. Oh, hoo -hoo, let's go. Cherizard V Star. So I actually didn't buy, well, I didn't buy this one. So I did buy some singles. That's what I was hinting earlier. Uh, but I didn't buy this one because I know V Stars are kind of like V Maxes. So that this is V Stars are pretty much the V Max replacement for this year. So probably the next year or two, we will see V Stars similar to V Maxes that we saw in 2020 and 2021. 
Uh, this is the Charizard one, so I feel like this is going to be easy to pull. There's going to be a lot of happy people in the box breaks pulling Charizard Vs, V Stars, and hopefully a Secret Rare one as well. Uh, so that's why I wanted to do a lot of box breaks with this one because this set is incredible, especially with the Arceus there as well. Uh, but we got to get this in a semi rigid. I, I might grade, I might grade a couple or one with Ace, and then I'll put the rest in my binder. I think it's. We will grade the Secret Rares with, I want to grade them with PSA, but obviously the delays with PSA, maybe CGC, I did a recent CGC submission video, if you guys want to check that, send some Charizards there, some Secret Rares odds as well, so check it out, but that is not a Secret Rare, this is just in the main set, as you can tell from the set number, and there we go. <laughs> A Flygon Full Art Seeker. Yo, Matt Cully, I saw your video the other day. Uh, I guess we are the Flygon Full Art gang. But yeah, this is the Seeker for this box. So not the best Seeker. Obviously, you guys have a chance in the box break to pull the Arceus, the uh, other old arts, the Charizards, which I'll show you at the end. But a Flygon Full Art is our Seeker for this box. However, there is a chance to pull two Seekers in a Japanese booster box. We have done it many many times we've opened hundreds and hundreds of japanese booster boxes last year maybe i want to say close a couple hundred boxes in total for sure we've opened last year so uh we definitely have pulled a lot of double secret rare boxes in the main sets because we do big uh box because we do box breaks of course like 10 booster boxes minimum or like we do big box break couple hundred packs you know uh so from the pool rates we have seen plenty of double secret rare boxes so it is uh, it's not like super hard. I think it's like one or two per case and the case is about 12 uh, Boxes per case uh, for Japanese So one two per case so one in 12 uh, Is the pull ratio uh, the rate for a double secret rare if that is accurate Maybe you can get more than that. We have got more than that We've got a couple se double secret rare boxes doing 10 boxes, etc So you never know and that's always a good thing especially with box breaks it means more people are gonna walk away with secret rares uh, But come on, let's go. Oh, okay Torterra here. Is that correct? Don't hopefully I'm not wrong there. That's the one from the Remember the Pikachu movie and he was the Detective Pikachu movie. That was a cool scene when the, actually it was a Torterra instead of like you have to watch the movie. Oh, maybe I don't spoil it, even though it did release three years ago now. Uh, but uh, oh, I remember I saw, he's in the game, but I forgot his name from Team Galactic. What is his name, guys? I always press, I spam the A button. I try and get rid of the chat as quick as possible. Now my chat setting on quick, so I never really read the chat in the game. Man just wants to battle everyone, you know what I mean? Oh, we got something here. Oh, okay, it's just the dragon typing. Uh, it's got the claws for dragon typing, even on non holo cards. I love the borders on the V Stars, though. It's super cool. Oh, Lucario, this is also going to be a pre release card in English. So if you don't know how pre releases work, these cards, these hollows, these artworks right here will be um, the exact same in the set. However, pre-releases will have the same ability, same tag, same HP, everything's the same, but a different artwork as well as a uh, pre-release logo. So you're basically an alt art form of the hollows or rares in the set, sometimes uncommons as well in the sets. Uh, so if you didn't know how pre-releases works, that is how it is. So I, I love Lucario, so it's cool to want to see Lucario and Moltres, the alternative arts. What will they do? How will it look? I think it's already leaked. It's already leaked online, the uh, pre-release promo. So you can have a look. It's on the uh, Pokemon website as well. Empoleon, I was hoping this was going to be a pre-release because I do love Empoleon. That's who I picked for my starter in the game. Uh, for Diamond, a uh, brilliant Diamond, sorry. Can't wait for Arceus. Arceus uh, Legends Arceus releases this week as well. I want to do a stream and like try and stream it, but I don't know. I don't have the setup for it. Like, I want, if I'm streaming video games, I want to have a face cam. And obviously, I'm doing these videos without face cam. So, hopefully, in the future, uh, when I have a proper setup for my game in my Pokemon channel, because I'll make sure I'll make space for that in my new house or whatever. Um, that we will do that and I can stream video games with you guys. But we've got another V Star. Please be Arceus, please be Arceus. Ooh, shaming, but I know there's a lot of shaming fans out there. So V Star shaming, and I love this bit here, how it separates it. And they're all the same on all of the V Stars. So it's pretty cool. I just love the pattern, like that border. It just makes it look so, so good. Like that. It's like a rainbow silver, like it's just an imp hand those borders on just a regular v-star not even a secret is insane but oh it's been a while since we've got a v there we go shame in v here so regular shame in v to go with the v-star looks like you need to have the v form to be able to 
uh, play uh, the V Stars. So if you are playing compa uh, competitively, there you go. But you probably know that if you are actually playing properly, or you probably looked it up, etc. But let's go. Final one now. Hoping for a double secret rare. Oh, and nothing there. So what I did pick up was these. So I did pick up the Rainbow Charizard from the set. The full art Charizard from the set, as you can see, the full art pattern is like a flame, so it looks so incredible in hand. I felt like the pictures didn't do this one justice. In hand is so much better. The alternative art Charizard, which you can pull in this set, guys. And of course, another Rainbow Rare, because I love Rainbow Charizards. And the thing about this Rainbow Rare, I have to admit, chasing, I love the chase for rainbows, but recently it's got pretty boring with the old arts there. Uh, the the like the rainbows weren't as appealing, but now the V Star Rainbow Reds are incredible with this border. Uh, it just looks so much more better, in my opinion. And then just everything the details, the V golden V outlines the details and everything. So I think Rainbow Chases is going to be hype again, especially a Rainbow Charizard. You guys know every set with a Rainbow Charizard is always hyped. And I've managed to get all the Rainbow Charizards apart from Burning Shadows, but I have bought. Uh, raw ones and a graded one of that, but I have pulled all the rainbows in the past uh, But there we go. We didn't get the Charizard V and I guess we may as well show you that one which I did get for free Which I did get for free from one of the Japanese sellers where I bought these singles from uh, They didn't give me the V star though, but yeah how cool is that? Can't wait to do the box break, guys. So if you want to get involved in the YouTube uh, box break, go buy your packs on FamousCrowd.com. I've got a limited amount of boxes because obviously we're doing TikTok box breaks. So some boxes will get used up for that. We will sell sealed boxes after the box breaks. So if you want sealed boxes, stay tuned till after the box breaks or we might box break it again. And then TikTok, we're doing one 8 p.m. today. And, and then we might do one on Friday, maybe Saturday. We can do multiple per day. Uh, really the TikTok shop and the TikTok experience like live stream is awesome the ability to buy on TikTok is so cool and it makes my life easier your life easier and it's just more fun like oh I want to get some packs let me buy some and see how it goes you know what I mean but it's UK only is TikTok but you can buy anywhere everyone can enter the YouTube one so buy famouscroll.com down below if you want to get into um, if you want to take part in the box break but guys like subscribe going to open for more of these so that is 120 packs for 100 pack opening for my personal collection so let's see if we can get a better secret rare. you guys can see the pull rates this video will go live friday so stay tuned guys make sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you then peace